Seven o'clock. Line it up. We're gonna start in two minutes. Hundred and twenty seconds. We are working Delahiva, Barambolo, and then tomorrow we're gonna work. Nah, tomorrow we're gonna work other Delahiva variations. Hey, Mike, let me use you. No, I don't know. let me try my. No, no, no. Let me use you really quick. So I want to just try something. I want to see if I can still like. So I knock you down. Uh -huh. Boom. So I lift this. Hey. Yes, everyone's back. Who's a Cowboys fan here? Bear crawl! Keep that butt off the ground, guys! And that other leg, I'm gonna try to scoop my hip forward. Boom. Now I go other side. Am I getting dizzy? Or Don't try to round your back. Keep it straight. Unless you want to look like Mr. Burns. I'm more of a Waylon Smithers myself. Burpees? I, I'm not doing burpees today. There's too many people, you know? We're gonna do hella push-ups. All right, guys! Circle up! Find your partner, someone your size and not your belt color. White belts and colors. I want no white belts together, Claw and Julie. Thank you. We're just gonna work one minute bear and bow drills back and forth. So, I got Mike, we're both gonna be in double pull. So I'm gonna go first, right? So we're go both gonna be in double pull. I'm gonna get a Delaheva hook, which is a leg around his and flex, no floppy feet. So I want four points of control still, even though he's sit sitting. So I have my Delaheva. This is controlling his leg. I have this control with my hand on his ankle. This control on his other hip, my other foot. And this collar. Three, four points of control. So all we're gonna do is back and forth like this. So I, I'm gonna, you're gonna keep your grips the whole time. Nothing's ever gonna let go. I'm just gonna, as I invert, like we did in the warm up, I'm gonna shoot my legs across his body. So my instep is in his pocket. You guys see that? Let's turn around. So the instep here is kind of anchoring his hip down here so he can't move. So all I want to do there from here, I just want to, I want to invert and I want to put my forehead in his hip. And I want to end up here, just back and forth. And then if you guys want to go other side, you can do it too. So De La Hiva, one control, two control, three control, four. So as I invert, I'm gonna shoot this leg across. I'll go here. It's important that my head is close to his hip. I'm not gonna get the bear and bowl if I'm far away here. I, I can't reach him and he has too much space to move out. So you guys wanna be able to close that space. You pull this as you're going under. So instead of just going like this, I'm pulling his collar, look. You see? And that allows me to get under and it brings him to me too. If you guys aren't familiar with De La Hiva and you guys don't have a good side, get good at both. Cause sometimes against like really good guys who know like how to defend like their good side, if you hit them with that other side, they're kind of lost. But let's partner up, one minute each. Spread out. <laughs> I guess it's like viral or bacterial infection in the back of your tonsils. <laughs> Who's touching your tonsils, dude? Who'd you kiss on New Year's? Come on, Phil. Your girl? <laughs> you have a girl, Phil? I do, I do. Shout out, shout out, Sharon. I'll see you later tonight or tomorrow, too. Hey, later tonight? Happy day! Yeah, yeah, later tonight! The Kita Bolo. The Kita Bolo's is getting your head close to that. Switch! To have the head close to the hip, it's no space there. Instep on the opposite hip to anchor him down. From here, it allows you, it gives you the time to get your like uh, far hip grips. So same thing with our Delahiva. I have my Delahiva hook, ankle grip, foot on the hip or thigh, collar. From here, I want him to post 
his hands like 45 degrees to my right. So I'm gonna pull, simultaneously I'm gonna kick. You see how he's like off to my right shoulder? He's not gonna like this, so he's gonna come back in. So as, before he comes back in, I know he's gonna come back. I'm gonna put my foot instep that's on his butt, I'm gonna put it on his thigh, and I'm gonna rotate as he comes back. I'm gonna rotate from my right hip to my left hip. So come back, as I get my De La Hiva hook back, and dump him. And then I could go for my bear and ball. So again, four points of control. De La Hiva, ankle, foot on the hip, collar. As soon as anyone ever does this, just kick. That should always be a reaction. Because if you let him settle here, like get low, like I can't move him. So like as soon as he does that, it's almost like a button, you know? But you know I'm already kicking. So again, I kick and put him over. If you guys want to go slow, go slow. So from here, get your, get your hooks back in. So he's going to come back in. As he comes back in, I'm just rotating my hip to turn with him and throwing, using that collar to push him down. So from here, we're just going to, you guys see I have my same grips. My insteps are, my insteps are in his pocket. From here, I'm going to pull and try to headbutt his hip. Boom, and get under. You guys, we're all familiar with this, right? We've been drilling this. I'm going to reach to the far hip. You guys see that? From here, I'm going to face him and kick. Boom. Now he falls right into back control. So again, I'm going to face him and kick. Get my hook, seatbelt. He got some points. Any questions? Partner on three. One, two, three. because it, it allows you to stay close to him. If you grab the legs, you're giving him space to move. Alex smells like ass, fool. <laughs> hey, it's a cigar. Fuck, dude. Nice, Roy. Hell yeah, beautiful. Woo! One step ahead. Dude, I like it, I like it. These Gracie Boo Hoo guys, I like it. Here's the thing with Gracie Bar. You can get like some sick Gracie Bar gins, and you can get like Gracie Bar you know? I mean, the corporate gyms are okay. I mean, like, being in this game a lot, there's a lot of... So martial arts gets like a lot... It's good for everybody, you know? Because everybody had like insecurities growing up. But with those insecurities, like when you get power, sometimes that shit magnifies, you know? So you get a lot of guys... It's like cops, you know? Like they, they've been bullied their whole lives. As soon as they get that power, they can't like wait to fucking use it, you know? And that's almost like the case with like a lot of like gym owners, like black belts, you know, like as soon as they get that like title, they use it for more harm than good, you know. Lionheart is good, like, like I told Julie, we have our, our new student here. I told her, she said she really liked this gym, but I told her, check out other gyms because you gotta f get the feel. Every gym has its own environment, right? What, what's good here, you might not like it, but you might like this place. Time, get water, circle up! I feel every I feel jujitsu is for everybody. You just gotta find the right place, right? Jim. You coming tomorrow, Cam? Oh, let bring that bring that gi tomorrow, dude. And a rashi too. Which one? He wants a GB. Oh, I'm gonna be fucking G beat out. Dude, I just cleaned up my own closet. How many you want? Fuck, I'll take them all, dude. I'll buy it. I'm gonna give it to you. Push up. Circle up, guys. We're starting. Another day, another spot. Since we got so many people, we're gonna do 10 push-ups, 10 squats, 20 jumping jacks. Hey, Alex special. Alex loves Yeah. So jumping jacks are actually jumping what? Jack My hair is crazy when I do this. Gotta figure something out here.
it up, truly. Thank you for coming again. 9.30 to 10.30, Saturday, women's gi. 10.30 to 12, no gi. 12 to whatever, gi. That's Saturday, starting February 10th. Great job, everybody. Let's bow it in. Thanks, Claus. Thank you. Boy, good job. Good job. Good job, good job. Good job, good job. What's up, man? Stockton. How was, uh, how was Jiu Jitsu changed your life? How did you change my life? Yeah, what way? Uh, I pay more attention to detail. Do you want, do you want serious answers? Yeah, 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 or whatever. It could be a funny answer. <laughs> no, I pay attention to details. A good example is I'm always, always been terrible at folding clothes, and I was making a point at the end of class. If you watch, I always practice folding my gi up nice, so, and I feel like it feels like a little win every day. Hey, good habit. You started with yeah, habit. it did, it did, and it helps. Even though I'm older as a white belt, it's reinforcing even better habits. Did? Yeah, yeah. And my boy's in. He's been doing it for a year. He's not going to compete in February, but I think soon he's ready. So I'm stoked yeah. for him. Thanks. It kept me really fit and helps me sleep at night because I'm exhausted from the class. And I uh, made a lot of good friends. Yeah. How has it? How has it changed your life? I've lost like 30 pounds already. Hey, hey yo, your girls. I, 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 could, I could get out of bed now. A oh, lot easier. A lot technical easier. Get up, technical, technical get up. Technical get up. You better be get up out of bed. Like, yeah, you like I'm ready to go. Yeah. It uh, Jiu-Jitsu changed my life by making me like more active. I get to think a little bit more. Um, I have like a hobby that I could uh, come to to like just do a lot of stress relief after after work. Uh, yeah, exactly. But also steam. It's built a, like a community. So I learned like during COVID, like oh my community is the Jiu Jitsu community. And so like when that goes away, I was like I have no friends. So this is, all, all my friends are here, dude. All my friends are here. I just like to choke my friends out, you know.